this is Francisco Guzman. I am a certified Enterprise PDM professional with GoEngineer. In this video, I would like to show you how Enterprise PDM manages SOLIDWORKS files and prevents broken references. As a non-PDM user, you may have come across a broken reference. Sometimes SOLIDWORKS cannot find a reference file because it might have been renamed, moved, or deleted. You may have been prompted to find the missing component or it may just disappear from your assembly. In this case, we can see that SOLIDWORKS cannot find the file. Navigating to the location where the assembly was saved, we see that the missing component was incorrectly renamed, causing SOLIDWORKS to not find the file. We can fix this problem by correcting the typo and reloading the SOLIDWORKS assembly. Enterprise PDM is great at preventing these type of referencing issues from happening. You can rename and move files, rename and move folders easily and safely, virtually eliminating referencing related issues. Here's an example. Here we have an assembly where all the components need to be moved to another location. Using standard Windows operations, we will highlight the component files, cut them from this location, and navigate to the new folder to paste the files there. We will also rename the engineered folder to engineered components. Navigating back to the project folder, we select the SCADE assembly and select the Contains tab. This tab allows users to see what components the assembly contains. In it, we find that all the references for the components have been changed effortlessly. Similarly, the Where Used tab shows where the subassembly is used. Had we done these operations outside of Enterprise PDM, we would be breaking references causing SOLIDWORKS to not find the files. Luckily, Enterprise PDM manages all the SOLIDWORKS references through the use of a database and updates them as they're changed. Opening the top level assembly in SOLIDWORKS, we see that all the references are updated. This has been Francisco with GoEngineer. I hope you liked this video.